Hello again, my friend. Today we are going to see how to make duck at home with marvelous taste. Let's start. Before starting, please support the channel by uh, like, subscribe, and the ring to get the recent uh, recipes. So today we are going to start with duck. I have two type of duck, the long one and the condensed one. It's only different for the parts that you like. If you like the breast, bring the long one. If you like the legs, the condensed one have a lot of meat in the legs. So we start with, uh, uh, with the duck. We remove uh, the plastic bag, uh, then uh, wash it a little bit with water. Then you put uh, some salt, baking soda, and use them to wash the duck from inside, outside, around, with a little bit of uh, vinegar. So after removing them from uh, the water, you take this uh, mixture, try to put anywhere you reach, even if you can reach between the skin and the flesh, try to do this. So this is remove all the blood that give bad taste to the duck. Because all of my friends, when I cook meat, they ask me, what spices do you add to your meat? And like chicken, duck, and meat. And I say, I didn't do anything. I just washed it. So this is how I wash. I leave it for like uh, one hour at least one hour, two hour, I put it on both sides and I wash it with, uh, like I rinse a lot of water until I get almost clear, uh, uh, clear water. Trust me, this is make big, big difference to your duck. Because this blood give you like a bad taste. You, you can eat little bit of the duck and you cannot continue because of uh, the smell of the blood. So then I got like, uh, when uh, you uh, dice the onion, I get the uh, onion juice with a little bit of salt. And this is like uh, uh, some way not to, uh, to give more taste to the duck with some salt. And I put it, boil it a uh, uh, little bit on uh, uh, on the stove you see like if if you are doing this you will find like uh, without wash this it won't be white like this so this is like the accumulated uh, uh, blood but because we wash it for, uh, very good with a good way so it become white not brown as usual so now um, I just put it to boil on both sides. Then I got a little bit of garlic powder, um, salt and pepper, uh, orange juice, some shredded carrot. So it just, I make like, give the heat to the flesh from inside. I'm not uh, making it tender. It just boil for like two minutes on both sides. Then I take this mixture. Try to put it around inside using a spoon. I I brought a, a like a pan and I put parchment not to make it like to prevent it from to be stick. And I put on both sides this mixture of shredded carrot. and the uh, orange juice. Then I take it to the oven from the top side. If you look to the soup, it's a clear. It's white, yeah. There is no brown. And I put it on 400 Fahrenheit. It takes around like one hour, one hour 20. Uh, so I cooked some Egyptian, like a rolled cabbage. I use the soup for the rolled cabbage one. It give it a very good taste. We, we usually serve this like uh, beside the, the duck when we cook duck in Egypt. 
So you see how much, uh, how, how it looks delicious, brown, crispy, and it lost all the fat. So when you eat it, you will eat a lot. There is no fat and the smell is so good. Yeah, this is how I serve it. Like I serve it with uh, ground beef by and uh, cabbage roll. See you in our next recipes and uh, please support the channel again by uh, like, subscribe and drink. Bye.